All right, ladies and gentlemen, today we are going to play through Mortal Kombat 2. How is this version of Mortal Kombat 2? Well, once again, it's one of the uh, closer versions to the uh, real arcade game. You'll notice at the startup screen we have Kintaro and Shao Kahn available, as well as Smoke, Jade, and Noob Saibot, as well as Hornbuckle. If we go this way, you got Red Robin. We are going to play through with uh, Hornbuckle today because he's a cool character. Why not? As you can see, the uh, music, or as you can hear, the music in this sounds more like Super Nintendo on the uh, character select uh, on the tower there. Sorry. You'll notice uh, Katana has some interesting moves there that she uses in the air. Uh, the original uh, Living Forest stage here, which is great, however, Hornbuckle doesn't have a big ability. So we're not going to be able to do that in September today. You're not feeding the tree demons. There you go, Hornbuckle. Sounds weird when they say his name. You'll notice at the bottom it says uh, combo and run disabled. Uh, to keep this one more true to the uh, arcade version, I disabled the uh, running and the combo system on this one. Just so it plays more like uh, Mortal Kombat 2. Now Hornbuckle does have uh, three different fatalities. We'll do, uh, we'll go through all of them. And then he has a friendship and brutality as well. Let's start off with the friendship. Wins. Friendship. Now as you can see, again, turn into a gorilla, an ape. Uh, it kind of looks like uh, Donkey Kong there, not gonna lie. But uh, anyways, <laughs> This version plays more like the arcade. Of course, everybody has more uh, special moves in it. Um, again, because you can set the difficulty, it's definitely more forgiving than the arcade, which is a great, a great appeal to uh, fans of the uh, the arcade game. And, uh, we do have it set on fairly easy here. It's funny that he uh, changes into a shadow priest. But uh, yeah, to get through the uh, the moves, to showcase a lot of the moves and such, I do have it on an easier setting. But this version plays very much like, <laughs> like Mortal Kombat 2. He's got three fatalities in this. Instead of a flying kick, he's got that. He has this move. Uh... Oh, he has this one where he drops from the uh, sky. Messed up that fatality. Wrong spot, obviously. Round one. Fight. That uh, one fireball is very powerful. There's a different uh, version of the uh, fatality in here, the acid pool fatality. I'll show you that. I love the way the announcer says Hornbuckle there. <laughs> but Rain has the uh, lightning coursing through his body, which is great. Something that they should have uh, included, but didn't in the arcade, unfortunately. Honey World Lead! Right. Gets knocked into the uh, front of the acid pool. And he's carried out of the acid with uh, one of the chains. Very cool. Cool version of that fatality. Fight. <laughs> Now you will notice Hornbuckle is actually a little bit taller than this version of Liu Kang. And he doesn't go. He does his uh, bicycle kick. Okay. 
There you go. Arbuckle. So this is a uh, great version. And with the uh, running combos too, I mean, it's a lot of fun that way also. Uh, for this playthrough, I just wanted to stick more to the, uh, the original combat. Let's uh, do Hitch Fatalities now. Crushes him with a Buddha statue. I believe it's something like that anyways. So that's his one fatality. Very cool. All back in here again. Again, these uh, Mugen stages are all random, so unfortunately we get the same levels a lot of the time. Especially when there's only a handful of them. But overall, I, I really do enjoy this version. However, because I am a uh, purist of uh, Mortal Kombat 2, I do enjoy the uh, the original arcade obviously more than this. But that's not to say this version is bad by any means. Fatality. There you go, he's got his original uh, cartwheel fatality, and then he has uh, one more, I believe. Have we seen them all? Actually, I think we've seen them all. So now he has, yeah, we have seen them all. That's right. Uh, actually, no, we haven't. There's one more. There's one more. That's right. It's, uh, his next fatality is, is pretty underwhelming, but uh, we'll we'll watch it anyways. I do like that they uh, took the time to uh, you know include some extra fatalities, extra characters. Uh, Hornbuckle has always been you know a mystery up until just uh, last week. Uh, I know it's just a Mugen, fan fan Mugen, so it's not uh, it's not actually included in any of the versions of Mortal Kombat. Basically just bicycle kicks you to death. Nothing fantastic, but still cool that they added something uh, different, something new. I do, do like that. The uh, combat tomb fatality is still the same. Two hit combo there. There you go. Fight. Oh, let's knock him into the spike, why not? The computer does get a lot more difficult when you set the uh, difficulty up. But for the sake of the uh, gameplay playthrough, we are just keeping it on easy. Push down, character drops. Awesome. Fatality. Faithful to the arcade. Round one. Fight. Baraka, so I believe, has a couple of special new special moves. There you go. I love how powerful this fireball is. I do think this is set up too easy though, as the computer's not doing anything. <laughs> Sitting there for, for the most part. Yeah, but I get a three hit there. But it's the, uh, the elaborate combo mode that they won't let you do because I have the setting turned off. And then of course there's one more combo. Which is the 
brutality. 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 So again, this is off the Mortal Kombat Complete Mugen, or Mugen, however you pronounce it. I like the uh, two shades of green here, that's cool. Curious if Hornbuckle has an ending. Might not. I can't believe they used a uh, donkey. Crushing them with the statue. Fatality. I'm curious if there's a secret character. You'll notice I'm using Hornbuckle right now. Hornbuckle is not in the back. He's not fighting Blades in the back because I'm using him. So there's a little bit of uh, attention to detail there that I, I like. I respect that. It's very cool. I believe there's still the uh, pit fatality here. Ooh, he grabbed me. Grab me out of the air for the uh, backbreaker. That was interesting. He really grabbed me out of left field on that one. Here we go. Looks as beautiful as ever. Fatality. The Pit 2 Fatality. Alright, I believe this is the battle before. The, question, the actual question mark. Let me use low kick here just to see if that uh, Shank Fun looks pretty cool. Moves around like a, like a brainless uh, computer character. I used all low kick for that one. And uh, nothing, so let's just play through this. Uh, it's crazy. Now, Liu Kang, his, uh, his uppercut fatality used to be one of my least favorites, but it's really grown on me. <laughs> I actually really like the way it looks now. Flawless victory. Fatality. Let's see what happens, if anything. Blue portal page, I like it. <laughs> Curious to know if they stay. Uh, you will die, mortal. Tusty! For a uh, new Cybot name, maybe not. Or if they just say noobs, I We are going to. Ooh, I almost put me there. I like the inclusion of that babality, brutality. or brutality, sorry, to, uh, to be honest. I think it looks cool. And we do have a secret match, a 
not sure who it's going to be. And the uh, music's super loud here. <laughs> Let's see who it is. Fight. We got a Red Robin. Now, who is Red Robin? I have no idea. I did mention him at the beginning, just because I uh, already checked out to see uh, Dusty. Who he was? Uh, I don't. I have no idea who he is. I don't even think I've heard of him in the past as a rumor character. So I will definitely have to look into this after. Uh, he's got the moves of Scorpion, the stance of uh, Reptile. He does have the uh, Scorpion get over here, Harpoon. Can teleport. Red the Robin wins. Fight. So two hit there. Oh, like my uppercut went right through him. Not sure if that's a move or if that's a glitch. Dusty! Can't finish it. <clears throat> so it looks like that. Fatality. Did I win another round? I didn't even think I won two rounds. Maybe I didn't. So maybe this game is a little bit broken. Regardless. Nice. Uh, so it's letting me do uh, combos. If I can jump in. If I'm getting close enough, I can do combos with the uh, horn buckle, anyway. Oh. I jump right into that one. Not too hard, however, and the uh, background remains the uh, same as the uh, original Mortal Kombat 2. Kintaro, the uh, fire breathing Shokan. There we go. Prepare for final battle. And we will see if uh, good old Hornbuckle. I am Shao Kahn. Feel the wrath of He has an ending. Fight. Pretty sure you can just beat him with uh, fireballs. Is that your last round to fight? Feel the power of Mr. Stand Still. Oh well, you know what? No. Playthroughs are fun. Yeah, there was no challenge in that really. But it was fun nevertheless. There you have it, Hornbuckle on the uh, Mortal Kombat 2, Mugen uh, Complete. Another great version of the game would definitely be a lot of fun with another person. And there you have it. Doesn't look like there's an ending for a good old Hornbuckle either. So we will let the uh, 
credits run. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. I do appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your day.